YouTube. It's me again. You're, I'm doing my re-review of Super Mario Brothers. Now, you might be asking, Hey, Brian, why are you doing another review? You just did one, like, six months ago. Well, those um, videos are very bad reviews. I don't like them. So I'm going to do them again, and I'll make sure that they're much better now. So, here it goes. Enjoy. Oh, and another thing. I'm probably going to... Uh, continue doing all my reviews like this in this form and it's gonna be okay now because I have a script now and I'm just gonna do it like this cuz I don't feel like recording and then talking it's too much problem for me and I can and now I can actually do it like this cuz my television used to be right there and my bed is still right here so I had no rooms to put my camera on anything. I'm I'm had the camera on the desk, so it'll be much easier now. And I'm gonna do reviews uh, of NES games, Super Nintendo games, Genesis games, and Wii and N64 games here. And I'll have to do my Game Boy reviews um, on the emulator. So that, that's all I have to say. Bye. Super Mario Bros. was released for the NES in October of 1985 and it quickly became an instant hit. The basic story is that Bowser has kidnapped Prince, Princess Toadstool and sub to Mario to save her. You have to go across 32 levels, a total of 8 worlds, battling Goombas, Koopas, Koopa Troopas, the, the Koopas that fly, and Blackatoos, the, the clouded enemies that throw shells. You gotta be careful with the Koopa Troopas because if you hit them, and they might bounce back and kill you. Mario has many powers such as uh, the Fire Flower, the Star, and of course the Mushroom. I didn't explain any of them because y'all know what it does. At the end of each world, you come to a castle where you fight a disguised enemy like that looks like Bowser. It's not really Bowser because if you kill it with the Fire Flower, and you'll see that's a regular enemy you fight in each, in, in every level. The real battle is in the eighth castle, and whenever you you uh, defeat one of those, you save a toad. But our princess is another castle, right? You can also get extra lives by either getting a hundred coins or finding secret blocks that. Here's a trick, whenever you get to the end of the black hole, always go to the black hole whenever the last digit says 3, that way you can get extra points. But because of the fireworks, every firework is 500 points. See? So bottom line, Super Mario Bros. is one of the greatest games of all time, and you should have played this in your childhood, if not you lived under a rock. I didn't play it on the NES, I put it on the... On the Super Nintendo with Super Mario All Stars. So, yeah. Thanks for watching, everyone. Hope you enjoyed. Have a good night.